hypothetically, what is your one rep max you think today? Right now? Yeah, not that we're going to test it today, but what do you yeah. think it is? Yeah. 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 Yep. Come on. There it is. Oh, yeah. 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 Okay. Let's go, David. Come on, man. Strong, man. Strong. You got this. PR lifestyle is more than just hitting a PR on the squat bench or deadlifts. A PR could be going a week without skipping a meal. It's about being the best version of yourself, always improving. Back to China, guys. Here we are at Desert Bar for Best Powerful Gym in Dubai with Oka and Semi. Okay, so this is an interesting duo. He just finished his Master G competition. Yes, and it's another competition. Is in incredible shape, and he did a 380 kg deadlift at 21. Uh, at 21 years old and only 93 kilogram body weight. So that's barely over 200 pounds. <laughs> this was a raw lift, right? No suit, no straps. Oh, yeah, IPF lift. IPF lift. Yeah. Very, very impressive. Uh, so naturally, we're going to deadlift today. Sorry, my friend. Uh, he hasn't <laughs> deadlifted yeah. pretty much once, more than once yeah. in your life. I'm the usual men's physique athlete with the small calf. <laughs> <laughs> See, there we can relate. See, I know all about the small calf lifestyle. So. We're going to do deadlifts. I got to do like six, six sets of, I think, doubles or singles. I am two weeks out from my mock meet, which we got here at Desert Barbell. And I did have a very long, intense armor with Sabin and his master yesterday. So to prevent any potential injury, but Levon told me he injured his wrist doing the deadlift on the same day. Um, this is the following day, but my wrist did endure a lot of stress. So I'm gonna need straps. Okay. Just in case, do that stretch with three, four in the kg. Yeah. Uh, I think it's a bit dangerous right after I had a very long, hard arm wrestling practice. Yeah. So I'm not worried about my grip strength. I'm just missing one week. I'm more worried about getting my wrist injured. So I'm gonna yeah. use straps, okay? Yeah. And we'll get to it. <laughs> You'll be the best one that looks at doing it, so it's all good. Which for fresh out of a show? Yes. Yeah, I think Last week I was sick, so I don't know really well, but I think 310 maybe should okay. be uh, 310, 310. Be possible. With, with your presence here, <laughs> I think it should be possible, yeah? Okay, at 95 kg. 94. 94. Yeah, 94, 95, yeah. But your best is 380. Yeah, right. 
So what do you think is the big drop? Just the training you've been doing has changed since then? Or uh, yeah. What do you mean with drop? Because you said you did 380. Yeah. But you think saying today you're doing yeah, maybe 310. Yeah, my injuries. I have an injury in my optic tear here. And uh, I was sick last week. And uh, because of that, I think. Okay. You know, always at the competition, you're at a peak level. You're at peak strength. Right. And then it's always like a little bit going down. Of course. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, you can never be peak strength all year round. Yeah, Otherwise, you're going to be a peak, nice, right? than some people do when they're training for it for years. Yeah. <laughs> oh, nice. Really nice. Yeah, no problem. Yeah. sets of two and we'll increase two kg each set okay yeah so a small jump little by little increasing You gotta wait for the entire queue. Yeah, right. To take their attempt where you take your attempt. Yeah. And that could take 15 or 20 minutes. Yeah, even. if your flight's big, yeah. So you'll get cold, you won't feel warmed up anymore. You gotta be comfortable lifting literally, literally like your 100% max while cold. Yeah. And not no, no longer warmed up. Right. Uh, in training, if you go like I'm going, then you're gonna be uncomfortable in competition. Yeah. Because I'm doing a mock meet. It's only me there. Oh, okay. I can go at my own pace. Yeah. It's just me, then when I, I go when I'm ready. Okay. Right. Yeah. Otherwise, I would take much longer rest periods. Yeah. To make <laughs> competition conditions. Yeah. Okay. Got it. Oh, let's go. Shh. First semester. <laughs> Own it. Own it. Come. Come on. Yep. Come. Oh. Yes. Yes. Oh, <laughs> Without belt, right? Yeah. Well, no. yeah <laughs> That's I, mean, I can't do it with a belt, right? Because of my respiration, I don't think it's good for me. I don't You're know. comfortable in a belt? Yeah, I'm comfortable. That's different. Yeah. I mean, for me, a belt, I guess for you too, a belt's yeah. a must. Without the belt, I don't can't I'm not used to it, you know? <laughs> yeah, it's very uncomfortable. Yeah, we get used to it. I'm not used to it. You'll feel better, 100%. Yeah. Let's go, Larry. Yeah. Easy. Whoop. Yeah. Your pull at the end is very strong. So from the bottom, I made 
maybe a little bit heavier, but that it just yeah. Yes. You know what I mean? Yeah, uh, I feel more comfortable locking it out now. Yeah, yeah. For sure. Uh, maybe in my setup, I'm sitting a bit too low. Okay, which yeah. Which is affecting maybe. my power off the floor. Yeah, maybe. Maybe I can set up a bit higher. Yeah. My hips a bit higher. Because from this point, it's, it's a little bit slow, but then you just <laughs> pull it, yeah? Yeah, the lockout feels very comfortable. Yeah, lockout. <laughs> Sir. I'm used to going at this pace, yeah. so it's okay for me. Not a mock me, I would take 10, 20 minutes rest yeah, as well. Yeah, yeah. Even if I don't need it, yeah. I would still wait to train hard, but yeah. yeah. Let your heart calm down a little bit, yeah? Breath, no. Yeah. I would sweat a little cold, dry up, as you would in competition. Yeah. And yeah. get comfortable being uncomfortable, and you'll feel at home when you get to competition. At my German Nationals, there was, uh, the flight was like 30 people, so. <laughs> The, the oh. breaks would be very long. Yeah, Maybe even minutes. 30 minutes without any people. Yeah. yeah. Imagine you're doing your for opener at like 90, 95%, and then 30 minutes later you take yeah. your second attempt. Yeah. So you want to prepare for those conditions and training. Yeah. Because you never know. Maybe you get a short flight. Maybe you get a long one. Chances are you get a long flight. Yeah. That's right. So prepare for the worst. Right. So you're finished, yeah? I'm done here, actually. Okay. Yeah. 
okay. Yeah. Maybe I will take five more minutes and then I will try it again because the 300 <coughs> should, be, should be possible. Of course, <laughs> yeah. Have you done 380, 310 you said you yeah. need to do today? Yeah. Yeah, this is no problem for you. Just a matter of rest. Yeah, right. That's all. And then I never did the double set, so double uh, rep sets before the, my PI, right? Right. Mm -hmm. So I just went 260 and then 300. Yeah. I mean, so when I was training for a PR, I did the same thing. And that's the way you should do it. Yeah. You shouldn't pre-exhaust yourself with this many sets and reps. Yeah, one rep each. Uh, exactly. And there should be more significant jumps. Yeah. Like, for example, 15, 20% increase in weight. Right, right, right. Yeah. yeah. Maybe this will work. Mm -hmm. Ah, it's not strong enough. <laughs> I can fart if that's you want to. Okay, come. Come. Come this way. Ah. Ah. Come with the skill. Ah. Oh. Oh. Okay. Okay, ready? Yeah. Right, let's see it. Come, come, Smilla. Come, go, let's go. Yep. Come on. There it is. Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. 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 That was a long rep. That was yeah. A rep. Long rep. Let's say pause deadlift, right? <laughs> Let's say pause deadlift. Yeah, you had several pauses there in that case. Really good. Oh, yeah. That was a true one, Max. <laughs> for, today, yeah. for today, yeah? For today. For today. Especially because short rest period, not used to that. Yeah, and we're used to the double sets, yeah? We did six sets before we went to this set. Yeah. So. If you're not used to that, it's going to make a big difference. Normally, you would go to 60 to 100. Right. 100%. Right. Yeah. Or even bigger jumps, like 260, 320 I've done in the past. Yeah. I've done 320 to 410 in the past. 320 to 410? Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah. And to get you jump? Yes. And that 410 felt great. <laughs> that was a PR that day. OK. So your uh, uh, lifetime PR is 410? Uh, without straps. Or without straps, yeah. OK. Without straps. With straps, 422 to 3. What do you think is the current PR? Well, I'm going to try for without straps, like 330, 340. Yeah, Something like that. Yeah, let's see. <laughs> let's see. It'll be after squats and bench as well. Ah, OK. Of course. Yeah, right. So, yeah. 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 Like that. Um, on that note, look, we're wrapping this video. It's just Dallas today. Only two more weeks of training before my mock meet here at Desert Barbell. I want to follow these guys. Very impressive lifters, especially Thank you. you. Thank Doing you. 380. Uh, 93 kg. Right. We have a video from you, by the way. Yeah. You've probably already seen it. Adam probably added it already. <laughs> um, but we'll see you guys very soon. Thank you. Uh, I don't know how long you're staying in Dubai. Maybe we can get a squat or bench session in. Maybe, yeah. One, yeah. one more week you are here in Dubai. Okay, sick. Yeah. Awesome. Thank awesome, you very man. much. Nice. Thank you, man. Thanks for having us. Yes, yes, sir. Of course. See you guys soon.